Well, here we are. Just uh, not giving an update. So we can see what much change there has been in the plants. Getting ready to separate. Move uh, the peppers and the tomatoes and this lettuce on over to this side over and over here. Which I'm going to be putting together tonight and I'll do an update after I do that. Uh, the spinach right here. and. Uh, I almost had a frost last night. I had to cover everything up again. Boy, you gotta love living in northern Michigan, you know. Uh, but uh, everything's doing really well. I uh, went ahead and changed the tank out yesterday in the reservoir. Um, new water, put some new uh, nutrients in. Everything's doing pretty good. Um, tomatoes are growing fairly well. We're getting some good, decent root growth. Give you an idea. Um, good enough to go into the larger ones. I mean, that's the main object of these lower buckets here is that I've got an upward spray on them so it hits the bottoms as we're producing roots. Where on these, I've got a lower spray action, which the reason for this is. For lid leaks, um, if I had these sprays going up towards the lids, these, these lids on these types of tubs kind of like to drip, and then you lose your water, and it's enough drip to make you concerned where you got to watch your reservoir every day. Um, right now, I just uh, uh, the reservoir is holding really well. I'm very satisfied with that, and for being outdoors. Um, but uh, and the spinach here is doing fairly well. Bring up the root system on the spinach, and I'm sure it'll start doing better. But I find spinach is just hard to grow. It's not one of the easier plants. It doesn't take off like tomato plants. It doesn't take off like lettuce. Um, and the pepper plants got hit by the frost. We're doing pretty good. You can see back here we got do have a pepper going. Uh, I flowered that a while back. I was these plants were flowering really, really well, and Jack Frost kind of took them back a stump. But I'm sure that uh, after a little bit of time here, they're going to start flowering again. Um, and I'm hoping that the tomato plants will start doing the same thing here soon too. Um, Produce some flowers, and we'll start getting some tomatoes going. They're looking pretty good. And uh, so, and the lettuce here is doing rather well um, for just starting out. But I'd imagine in a couple weeks it'll look like that. So, that's about it for now. Just thought I'd do an update. And we're going to be changing some things around, and who knows? Maybe try to grow something else.